Hello, Divine Collective. Welcome or welcome back to my channel, Divine Goddess Enlightenment. I'm Ashley, and I am here with a down low for you guys. As you come in, don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already. Make yourself at home. Hit the bell so you can be notified every time I post a read. I hope you guys are having a fabulous Sunday. I'm doing well. Um, the link to my self-published poetry book, The Unpolished Diamond, will be in the description as well as the About section. I'm also going to leave the link to my podcast, you guys. It's, my podcast is also called Divine Goddess Enlightenment. Okay, so Divine Ones. Oh yeah, before I start, I must thank all my new subscribers. Thank you, thank you. All my day ones, thank y'all. Uh, thank you all just for the love, the support, y'all kind words, the comments. Like, you guys are really awesome. And, like, when I go through y'all comments and I read, like, the love, like, I just feel the love, like, when I read y'all comments of, of love, of uh, support, okay? And I really appreciate that. Like, y'all be making my day. And that's the that's what's up. That's the vibes, okay? So, shout out to my divine ones, okay? So, let's hop in, though, y'all. This is the download I got. This karmic copycat that's in secret, like, is in secret competition with you and they still losing. <laughs> like, yeah, those are, so those the vibes. I know this, uh, this kind of confused me too when I got this download. Like, how, how does that work? So, yeah, but it's crazy. Like, and you guys, I picked up on a Taurus. So this person could be a Taurus, um, or you could be a Taurus or you have a lot of earth in your chart. Okay, but it's crazy because I'm kind of picking up on, um, for some of you here, I'm not just picking up on one individual. It's a group of counterfeit karmics out here, okay, and secret competition with you and losing day by day, day by day, okay? So um, I really pick it up for, for a couple of you guys here. You are readers, okay? And I'm picking up on another reader, okay? Another reader that's been secretly sending you and your channel e evil eye. This person could be uh, reporting your content, okay? Uh, so, yeah, I, I'm he it's heavy on that energy, okay? And for others of you, I picked up on, like, a childhood friend, okay? Someone uh, uh, that was, like, family to you, or this could be a family member, like a cousin, a brother, a sister, okay? An auntie, an uncle, okay? This could be anyone, but this is just not one person, okay? But it is a reader here, okay? For my readers, if you have some type of platform, you in tarot land, it's a reader sending you and your channel evil eye and um, reporting your content. And this person is someone, this person studies you. This person had a notification zone every time you post, okay? This person is obsessed with watching you, okay? And uh, yeah, and this person inserted themselves to this one-sided secret competition and mad because they lose it. That's insane. But yeah, um like the divine is sitting back laughing at the at laughing at these clowns, okay? The divine is saying they could never, all right? These energies are being looked down on and being looked at as pathetic, okay? Pathetic, all right? Every time these energies attempt, attempt to do what you do, they fail, okay? Cuz like I said, I picked up on the energy that Jack sits back and literally study and watches your every move. This person want to talk like you. This person want to look like you. This person want to eat what you eat. This person want to post what you post. If this person could, this this person would, would, would uh, try to swap souls with you. It's that deep, okay? This person is like a fucking, like a lunatic, some type of maniac, okay? This person, this person could actually be, have the traits of a psychopath, okay? If this person is not a full-on psychopath, this person has psychopathic traits here. That's really what I'm picking up on because this person hates your guts, but they sit and watch you 24-7 in anger and enrage themselves every time they see you shining. But and it's like, that's where I get like, is something mentally wrong with this person? Because if you don't like someone, if you're not in tune with someone, if you really don't care for an uh, energy, why are you continuously... Uh, Spirit is saying this person is torturing themselves. Why are you continuously tor torturing yourself watching a person that you can't stand? I don't get it, okay? So yeah, uh, this person sits back and they try to attempt everything you do, okay? They try to emulate and embody your essence here, your personality, uh, and just what makes you you. And they always come up short. Everything they try to do, 
everything they try to attempt to do that you have already done, it fails, okay? And Spirit is saying they're going to continue to fail. They gonna Everything they touch is going to continue to disintegrate because this individual is uh, sending you evil eye. This individual is sending you evil intentions. This individual is not pure. They're not authentic. They're, they're a fraud. They are counterfeit, okay? Um... And spirit is also saying this person will always fail. This person will always come up short because this person is trying to walk and walk in your in your purpose. Okay, this person is trying to walk in the energy of your destiny. It's simply not their destiny. It's simply not their purpose. This person is having a real hard time staying in a lane, and your ancestors really going uh really go has to rectify it and show what it is. Okay, because you're not one of those. Okay, so yeah. Um, like Spirit said, it's not her purpose. Okay, they this this these energies try to do what you do, but it's just but it's just not given. <laughs> like Spirit, Spirit is saying like it's just not given here. Okay, it's not given. All right. So what else I have? Like th these this individual these individuals know they they are karmic. Okay, she knows. Well, for a lot of you, this is a karmic feminine here. She knows. She's a karmic, okay? And knows it, all right? They know it, all right? And uh, she really hates, like she internally hates her existence. She internally wished she was you. She do, as every day, she put her energy into trying to copy everything you do. And this is why she will forever come up short. She will, for, and your ancestor is gonna make sure of that, okay? Um, I also got, Like I said, I'm not, I'm just, I'm picking up on more than one energy that's copying you out here. You have a group of counterfeit karmics trying to be you, okay? If you a reader, I'm picking up on, you have other readers and tarot and emulating and copy, copying you. You even have your own family doing this, okay? You have, it's a childhood friend, a childhood cousin that, that you cut off that's continuously trying to emulate who you are. All right. And it's just like, like spirit said, it's not given. All right. These people look pathetic. They look like fools out here. Okay. Because my fuck, people could see through the facade. People could see through this illusion that these karmics are trying to paint. It, a real one is going to look, it's going to see straight through the BS here. Okay. Uh, what else do I have? Like, like for, for this family member here that's always been envious here, you discovered this copycat has been jealous. Like you recently discovered spirit exposed that this copycat has been jealous and envious since childhood days, okay? This could be a family member you went to high school with, or this could be a high school friend that turned into an enemy, okay? But even when you were connected to this person, you picked up on this person doing certain things and and copying certain things you did, okay? And it, it almost went over your head because it was like in plain sight. And it did go over your head because you you wasn't looking at it that way, okay? You really wasn't looking at it that, that way. But now that you are detached, you see that this energy was blatantly trying to be you and your face, okay? So what else do I have here? Like, people are sick of these... of uh, these weirdos, okay? People are sick of these energies speaking on you, okay? Um, they they sick of these weirdos speaking on your name because they know that this coward doesn't have the the courage to step to you, okay? Like like I said, um, this is this is multiple people here, and it's it's specific karmics out here that's continuously speaking on your name to their karmic friends. And these karmic friends is startled. They like they they sick of they sick of this person speaking on your name because they like dang you 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 speak on this person every day you throw shade on this person every day but you don't you not go say you scared of this person you don't have the courage to step to this person you don't have the courage to really tell this person how you really feel so we really don't want to hear that okay people are really starting to see what's really going on here okay all these karmic individuals are scared of you they fear you. 
Okay, they know who you are on a spiritual energetic level here. All right, they know you have power. You hold you hold a lot of rank, and you have the uh, you 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 call you have the authority to call judgment. Okay, and they know you are highly you are held in high honor uh, by the divine by God here. I just seen ten ten October tenth is highly significant Libra. All right, this person could be a Libra, or you could be a Libra, but yeah, and the divine is sick of this person too. Okay, and if this was someone who had any type of little the little power they thought they had, they did they have been stripped because they thought it was sweet to come for you. Your ancestors had to humble this person. Your ancestors had to give this person a reality check. Okay, because this person was just vibing in this illusion, thinking it was sweet when I when in actuality it's been known they came for the wrong one. Okay. And it's like everything this, uh, these individuals know, especially this karmic reader here, everything this individual know is because of you. Because this person sit back and study your every move. Okay, this person want to move like you. This person want to dress like you. This person literally wants to wants to look like you. This person wants to be you, okay? And this person sits back and study you. They learn, they learn from you. This person... Uh, they they learn from you, okay? Like I said, because because this person is studying you, okay? Especially if you have a platform, this person is sitting back, studying, literally taking notes. Literally, I see someone with a, with a paper and a pen, literally taking notes, and that's why this person is it, this person is been has been uh, they they dried up, they tied out. Okay, their energy is 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 washed up here because they using all their energy to focus on you. All right, they use all their energy to focus on you to the point they neglecting themselves. They neglecting their own path. They neg thank you, spirit. They neglecting their own mission here because they too busy. They giving you free energy, okay? Free energy. <laughs> they giving you, y'all. They they literally giving you their energy here, literally. Okay, this is why no matter what this person do, okay, to try to bring you down it only is it's like you get better and better and better and this person just sink lower and lower and lower here okay and i also was getting like this energy try to click up with others okay this energy clicking up with others uh to attempt to start some type of hate campaign thank you spirit to attempt thank you spirit to <laughs> To start some type of hate campaign in, in regards to you, okay? Um, I, I picked I picked up on group magic too, okay? I feel like th this person is doing everything they can to try to get others to be against you, and this this is people you don't even know here, okay? This person is trying to start some type of uh, hate campaign, all right? When it when in regards to you, okay? But the divine is saying they don't want them problems. That they, they don't want no smoke, okay? The spirit is saying your ancestors is saying they should sit this one out because they don't want these problems here. <laughs> I speak spirit, okay? So you got it's just sick, right? The lengths people will go to try to get other people to dislike you. And any person that could be easily swayed to not like a person they don't even know, they have an issue. They have a problem. They're mentally insane. They're mentally, chemically imbalanced here. Okay? That, and I, I pick up a person like that is also weak. This person has no, no backbone. If it's that easy for you to attack or go against somebody you don't even know, you are weak. You are weak. And that's just period. Okay, and like I said, I picked up our group magic. Like it's like I said, it's a group of karmic counterfeits. Okay, that's trying to siphon your energy, and it would never happen. And these and this individual is noticing they everything they doing, everything is being washed up. Okay, they they washed up, they tied out because they keep giving you your energy here. All right. I also got like I said. Uh, like this, this, these energies, this group, whatever this is, these counterfeit karmics attempt, attempted to uh, mess with your stability. Okay. Attempted to mess with your stability here. All right. And I was getting an energy like that, that this person already did. This person attempted to send you something. This person sent you the evil eye in some type of way. This person attempted to send you some type of evil intentions. Okay. And um, it backfired. It backfired. And this person is realizing this because everything that this person has or everything uh, this person, like, 
put their energy in or did put their energy in is desiderated. Okay, this person is literally giving you their energy. All right, every time they, they come to your page and study you, stalk you, every time they speak your name, okay, every time they send you the evil eye, this person, they, they think it's having an effect on you, but it's only making you better. All right, every time this person attempts to spiritually attack you, your ancestors boost you up, boost you up even more. And this person came, it's like they're like delusional. It's like they don't want to uh, accept the fact that you really this high ranking divine being and they really messed up and they really, they, it, they cannot compete where they don't compare. This person will never compare to you. You are divine. They, they are fraud. They are karmic pretending that they are divine. Okay. Uh, what else? So yeah, like I said, they attempted to do the to uh, send you this uh negative energy here, and it backfired. Okay, and if this is another reader, all right. If this is another another reader, because for uh, for a lot of you, this is this is a, another reader. Okay, and they see this, they see that with the things like the negative intent they see they said to you, they see that. The, you more high ranking and it don't have an effect on you because this manifested in a form of they channel declining. Okay. They 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 channel is 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 washed up and dried out. Okay. Why? Because this person was continuously sending you evil eye, continuously imitating you. This person, they, they want to smoke with you. They they really want to smoke with you and they got sat down. They got humbled real fast. Okay. Yeah. So Yeah, like the divider said their channel or whatever they have going on is dry and washed up because they thought it was sweet to come for you, okay? And I pick up this person is someone unstable, all right? Mentally unstable, okay? This person, like this false divine person, this uh, karmic that's disguising himself as, as divine and someone, this person is unstable. This person has not fully done any healing or any shadow work, okay? This is someone who attempts to teach and guide others, but they never lived these experiences. They never been through this, okay? They, they never overcame or been through the experience what they trying to teach and guide others in. This is what make them a fraud. This is what make them a counterfeit, okay? How are you trying to heal, guide, and teach others when you still have shadows and issues within yourself? Speak, spirit. Okay. Spirit said they need to stay in a karmic, they karmic A lane. I'm trying not to cuss y'all. Okay. They need to stay in a karmic A lane because you're unbothered. Okay. And your ancestors gonna continue to sit this person down every time they think they're gonna come for you. Period. So let's hop in. This go for the whole group of karmics, okay? Whole group of karmic counterfeit karmics out here. All right, trying to disguise they self as you. Uh-uh. This person got this <laughs> funny. All right, because the person that that said me evil eye was sitting my channel evil eye. My ancestors hum humbled that lady real fast. She got humbled real quick. And it's actually hilarious to me. <laughs> yeah, don't don't you can't come for a real one, my baby. Don't don't uh don't make that a mistake. Don't get embarrassed. Stay in your karmic lane here. Everybody is not to be f with, and I'm one of them. Period. So we're gonna get a room first. I want to pull a. Ooh, it fell on the floor. Oh, speak spirit. We have Ansus, ancestral gods. Okay. This is the rune of the gods here. Okay, this is the rule of the guys here. Like I said, a, a lot of us are not to be messed with. Okay, a lot of us are guys and goddesses here, and we have the rank and power to call judgment and did. Okay, and whoever these karmics is, you you high you rank higher than all these karmics. Okay, and they are now is they are now like getting set down. They are they have got humble. Your ancestors really has to humble and give these energies a reality check of who you are. And that you are not the one. And they, they should have stood down. Okay? Ancestral guys here. The initial A could be highly significant. First, middle, last uh, initial. All right? We have the voice of the universe here. Okay? This is your room about the truth and avert the voice of the universe. Okay? This person, these energies are bothered 
by like like you're the voice you are uh you're authentic you're the voice for the people here okay you're like an advocate you're an advocate for all the chosen ones here okay you're an advocate for the divine beings like i said you're a high you're a high ranker here okay and you're an advocate you for the universe okay you, you're like an ambassador here and these people they cannot stand your position they're bothered by your rank. They're bothered by the authority that God gave you. They bother that you're the truth. You you're actually real. You're you actually speak the truth. You're actually authentic. You're actually a real divine being. You're actually a real emperor or empress here. All right. And it it, it eat the, these energies up. It, eat these it, these individuals up every day because they know they are counterfeit and they can never hold a candle to you. Okay. So yeah, we have commun this is about uh, communication and advice as well. Okay, like I said, like I said, with the with the advice man here, all right, this person is someone that sits and, and learn from you. This person actually learned things from you. All right. This person actually learned and try to apply different things that that you you teach here. Okay, because this is someone that study your every move. This is someone that literally watch you with a pen and a pad. Okay, this person's sick. It's giving weirdo. It's giving creep here. All right. This is this room is also connected with uh, poetry. So you could be like myself. You could be a poet. You write poetry. You write short stories. Okay. You could be an author that I'm speaking on. Okay. This this energy and like these energies are pressed because you you because your universal connection. All right. And because you are a teacher, you are a true teacher. You are not no false prophet. You're not a false reader. OK, you you are a, you're not a false teacher. All right. You are a universal teacher from a divine here. OK, a universal light worker here to help others with their spiritual growth. These energies are also pressed because of your level, your level of uh, spiritual growth here. I don't know why I just it look kind of different. My lightning. Okay, but let's get let's get back to it. But yeah, your your level of spiritual growth. Okay, like I said, your rank is higher than all these individuals, these counterfeit karmics that's coming for you. Okay, you the you they they can never. Your spiritual growth is literally through the roof. This is why you have that rank to help others, and they don't. Okay, they literally it's like with with these individuals, it's the blind leading the blind. Okay. They have no real spiritual wisdom or spiritual knowledge. And you're very wise. You're very knowledgeable. You actually teach people. You just don't come on your platform talking about all this karmic stuff, okay? You, you, even if you do, that's cool. We, we pick up on that at times. But like, like someone like myself, like I'm going to speak on certain karmic situations, but best believe you're going to learn, like from any reading, I have is you gonna learn something, okay? And these these energies, they don't have that ability to do that because they have no real wisdom, they have no real knowledge. All they know is karmic, karmic, karmic. They not teaching about self development, self improvement, healing. All right, bossing up. All right, they not speaking on that because they not in that energy. Speak spirit. So yeah. <laughs> so let's uh. As I pick up my deck here, you guys, karmic father, this person has daddy issues, okay, that they never, they never healed. Initial L, first, middle, last initial here, all right, the initial D. Let's get some energy, though, from my deck. Let's get some overall energy spirit. Yeah, but that, that's the vibes here. This person is in these, all these people in secret competition with you and still losing. You don't even you ain't even know these people inserted themselves to be in this one sided competition with you and they still losing with a clown. Okay, let's get some up. <laughs> Stolen identity. Ooh, look, look at spirit say these these energies trying to steal your identity. They try to steal your aura, your essence, your swag. Okay? They literally, if they could, they literally would, like I said, they would soul swap. They would literally try these. People will literally try to swap yo know, try to steal your soul, bro. Okay. This could be an energy for someone here. This could be a person that actually did some type of identity theft. Okay. Stole your ID. Got something in your name here. Okay. Wow. Stolen identity. They want to embody everything about you. 
They want to embody everything about you. They want the love and support you get, okay? They want to embody your intelligence, the way you articulate, the way you speak, okay? Your, your knowledge, your glow, your personality, okay? This, is, this person, these people sick. Like I said, they unstable. They unstable and imbalanced. They're counterfeits. It's working in your favor, okay? Like I said, they attempted to send some dark, dark energy your way, an evil eye, okay? And it was discovered because it backfired. It backfired instantly. Your ancestors uh, sent this person a reality check, okay? Th these energies, they hate your, your universal connection. They hate your ancestral connection. They hate how everything appears to go in your favor. And, and it does. All right, because you you've you've did the work and you you've ascended, you've ascended to a le a level of a master here, a spiritual leader, a spiritual master here. All right, these energies say hey, how everything works in your favor, and, and, and all the evil eye they send to you. Like every time someone spiritually attack you, your ancestors raise you up another level, boost you up another level. Okay, you get you you just. Ascend more, okay? And these people, they continue to sink. <laughs> I can't make this up. Speak, spirit. Jealous of your beauty. It's someone here that's jealous of how you look, all right? Jealous of, uh, I'm getting to the attention you get from the opposite sex. I can't, look, <laughs> spirit, high school enemy here. Like I said, this even this even someone you went to school with. This is someone. Uh, this could have been a, a high school bestie or someone like a cousin or a sister you went to the same high school with. Okay, this person, like I said, it has spirit exposed to you that someone from your from high school days, someone you grew up with, has always been extremely envious. This also could have been someone that stole your identity. Some type that was in some type of identity theft. And this high school enemy is also someone that was always jealous of your beauty and, and the attention you got from the opposite sex. Okay. April could be highly significant. Wow. I want to I, I want to clarify some things here. It's a somebody playing a sample of Cameron that song. Oh boy. So New York could be highly significant. The name Cameron, Cameron, Karma, Carmen. I don't know why I just heard Angelica. You could have loved watching the Rugrats or your, your kids love the Rugrats. Or you grew, you grew up, you're a 90s baby. You grew up watching Rugrats. Okay, let's hop in though. Let's clarify. Well, first I want to get some overall energy from the tarot here. All right, spirit. Let's get some overall energy from the tarot. Some of my divine ones here. And spirit is also saying, like, these energies are energies that slander and gossip about you on a daily basis. And spirit is saying that they thought the lies that they spoke on you was stick, okay? But people see that this copycat is just a bitter hater, okay? People people see People see that this copycat is someone that's just a, is a bitter hater, hater. This is someone that spread lies and gossip on your name. This person literally tried every day, daily, try to throw dirt on your name to others, okay? Because this person is attempting to form some type of hate campaign, some, okay? But Spirit is saying, it's some people, they, they know the vibes. Like Spirit is saying, and it's a four swords of the reverse, y'all, that, that came out. Damn. Shit, y'all. All my cards just flew. But spirit is... What, what was I fit to say? My bad, y'all. This just... I need to shut my window real quick, y'all. My bad. Yeah, so that was the four swords in a reverse, Okay. 
And y'all know it's for a source and a reverse that speaks of, of someone unhealed. Like I said, this is someone that act like they so divine, that act like they so this, that they so that, that act like they're a true healer, a true teacher, but they don't, they, they haven't even done a work on themselves. Okay. They haven't even done, done a childhood healing, the inner child healing. They haven't done the shadow work, but they claim they, they out here claiming they can help others. Okay. This person, thank you, Spirit. And if this is a reader, because I am, you know, that's what I pick it up on. These false readers, they gonna get a spiritual violation for that. And a lot of these, like I said, the little power they thought they did have, that is being stripped and they been debunked. Okay. All right, maybe it it was a, a reader that uh had a little rank or whatever or had a little a little gifts or had a little you know a little say so but the moment they came for you they lost it all your ancestors not playing you rank higher than this person now this person got a spiritual violation and they have been debunked okay because this person refused to heal these are a bunch of unbalanced unhealed karmic counterfeits and I, that's what i was saying like these people was uh, trying to spread lies, okay? Speak it on your day, try to th th throw dirt on your day and try to recruit other people to do it. But Spirit is saying, they, need, they should sit this one out. Maybe they should sit this one out, okay? Because anybody involved is, is, is gonna be annihilated. It's a spiritual violation against all these karmic energies. It's a spiritual violation when people come for you. Clarify the four source and a reverse spirit. Clarify the uh, four source and a reverse. Oh, y'all could be highly significant. Oh, y'all deals with the way. Okay. So you could be a, a daughter of oh, y'all, son of oh, y'all. You could be working with oh, y'all, or you, you've given some type of inheritance. I, I said inheritance. So your inheritance coming. Or you, I, I meant to say offering, okay? Wow, or maybe like you're getting a blessing from Oya here. Oya is ushering in some type of blessing for you. And I see a fly. Like like I said, monitoring and spirits, okay? These energies, these energies monitor, monitor everything you do here, okay? Nine of Cups is clarifying the forest source and the reverts, okay? These energies are bothered because you, you, you did the work and you are emotionally fulfilled with who you are. You are secure in your abilities, okay? You're you're secure in, in your spirit, okay? And, you're, and other people look at you as a gift. Other people value you. Other people look at you as someone uh, very gifted, talented, someone of value, someone of high honor here. And this person, these individuals, karmic individuals bothered because they didn't do the work. But that's not, I can make this up, bottom of the deck. And that's the truth. Look, Spirit is speaking. Okay. They these people they don't like they don't love themselves. They never did the work. They don't like themselves. They mad because it's you. They mad because it's you. They mad at the truth you speak. And how others others are inspired and motivated by you and your energy and your presence. Okay. And like I said, this person messed around and, and got humbled. All right, and everything is drying up for this person because they was they was too busy focused on your cups. They was too busy focused on you. All right, putting their energy into you that they they mess around and miss their own blessing, their own gift. You got you took you you did body snatch. You did took all this person energy, but how because this person continuously give it to you. And I just said body snatch. So uh, it's something significant about body snatch. Wow, this person, this person is, it could be like an entity, okay? This person is vibing in the energy of an entity here, all right? This this jealous, hateful, envious person, all right? That's in the background trying to get what up on you. This person, it is secret, silent, competition, stay trying to get what up on you, and you don't even care about this person. You don't even care if this person breathes it or not. And this person is steady trying to manipulate and do things to try to seem better than you or superior, trying to one up. And they always end up looking goofy in the end. Speak, spirit. Whew. Okay. Clarify stolen identity, spirit. Clarify stolen identity. Okay. Wow. Look. Yeah. Someone. 
someone you that you've been around, okay? Someone you've been around, someone, this could be, like I said, a high school enemy. This could be a family member, a friend, okay? But someone you was around, I picked up this, you was around this person for a, a minute, okay? This person could have stolen something from you, all right? I can't make this up. So when someone here, your old friend or your old family member stole your identity, or they, they could have wrote a check in your name or did some type of fraud. Thank you, Spirit. Did some type of fraud in your name. This person could be like an actual scammer that do this type of shit. Okay? All right? It, it was all due to envy and jealousy. Okay? You have people, if these energies steal it from you because they, they, they want to be above you. Okay? You have people in the background take it from you. Okay? Because they want to feel superior. They didn't want you to outdo them or outrank them. This could be a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, or a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius here that, that literally stole your identity. Someone could be going to jail for identity identity theft. Yeah. Look. Every time this person look up, you you get you doing better. You shining brighter. You bossing up even more. You smiling even more. You getting even more love and support. And it's a burden on them. They they can't stand it. This person got wow, y'all gossip. Okay. And this person watch you and study you so much. They can't even sleep at night. This person don't even sleep. They be studying you, watching you. But look, spirit said it's judgment. All right. You call, like I said, you have the authority here. You have a you rank higher here. And you call judgment on this person. And you you see. Anybody that was dumb enough to click up with this person, getting it too. Okay? Let's put this here. All right? Now these energies are uh, are in regret. All right? Because your ancestors instantly, your ancestors instantly humbled these, these energies and put them in a place instantly. They instantly knew you was the wrong one to cut for. All right. That's why everything is ending around this person. Anything this person touch will not prosper. Okay. Will not prosper because they came for the wrong one. Okay. Clarify jealous of your beauty, spirit. Clarify jealous of your beauty. I don't know why I just heard what you gonna do. Do fella. Tupac could be highly significant. You could be listening to Tupac. Look, this is this is clarifying jealous of your beauty. Wow, Ted, Ted, Ted. And this is at the bottom. Look, y'all. Ted, Ted, Ted here. Something significant about October 10th. All right, Ted, Ted, Ted here. Okay? But with this clarifying jealous of your beauty, like I said, these are... Uh, these are karmic feminines or masculines in your family that's always been jealous of, 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 of uh, your rare beauty. You are you are a rare beauty, okay? Your very your beauty is very rare. You may even look like like people may say you look African or you look Jamaican, okay? Or you may be African, you may be Creole, Haitian, Jamaican. I'm picking up on you. Just have thank you, spirit. You just have those features. You have rare features, okay? And these energies, they basic, <laughs> they basic and average. And they, and they don't like the fact that like you're just a rare beauty here. All right. Your, your, your essence. Thank you, spirit. Your beauty is rare. This is family. All right. These energies are also bothered at the fact just that you're emotionally fulfilled and happy with who you are. All right. And you don't have to fake anything like they do. Okay. Yeah. Your ancestors standing on next one by one. One by one, they are finding out you are you are were the wrong where to come for <laughs> spirit. I spirits, uh, okay. Spirit want me to use my deck again some more. We have a demonic coven here, like I said. For that reader, the reader energy I pick it up on. This is someone that's a part of some type of uh, coven. Okay, this is someone that wants people to think that they're divine, but they're they're actually uh, they're actually karmics. Okay, who link up with other karmics to attack the thank you spirits to attack divine beings. These are fake karmic readers that link up with other fake karmic readers to try to attack the the real divine beings here. Okay, like I said, this person try to get other recruit other people to uh, 
to go along with this campaign, this hate campaign against you. And these people don't even know you. It's some people that's not going to go for it. Okay, it's some people that uh, that ain't gonna go for it, and that's what Spirit said that these they should sit this one out unless they want to get touched, and that's period. But it's gonna be some that is that's gonna be stupid enough to take the bait, and they gonna fall right along with this energy. Initial P, uh, first, middle, last initial. Look, y'all, I can't make this up. Spiritual goons, <laughs> your ancestors really have to uh, pay a visit. Yeah, thank you, Spirit. Your ancestors paid a visit to somebody. Your spiritual goals here. All right. Someone with black hair is highly significant. I'm getting Patty, Penny, Precious, Princess, Paige. I can't make this up. Check in your social media. Check, these, these people, they, they can't even sleep at night. They too busy watching you, stalking you, hawking you. They can't even, it's got to the point they can't even they don't they they can't even focus on what they have going on they completely gave up on their own mission to focus on yours well they never really had one in the first place because they some low-key karmics fooling a collective out here <clears throat> this person could be 33 years old you could be 33 like i said this person is in some type of uh cult some type of coven this person, thank you, Spirit. This person is an agent. This reader, I'm picking up on all these energies are agents. So even these energies, these high school enemies, these uh, family, these carbon family members, these fake readers, they are all agents of the matrix. And they're connected to other agents as well. Hmm. Speak, Spirit. Your siblings here. Siblings, highly, your siblings highly significant here. You have a sibling that's always been jealous of you. You have a sibling that tried to steal your identity. For someone here, you went to school with your sibling, okay? Your sibling name could start with a P, first, middle, last, initial. Your sibling could be 33 here. Arisha's protect you, like I said. Oh, yeah, I, I picked up on all oh, y'all energy. Oh, yeah, it's highly significant, all right? You have the, the divine, the Arishas really mess with you. Like you, you really, you really that, okay? You really that. A karmic aunt, like I said, I picked up on a karmic aunt at the beginning. Manifesting rapidly, okay? Like I said, every every time someone spiritually attack you, you move up another level. So I wouldn't even be really bothered too much because that's happening to me. Every every time somebody come for me, every time somebody try to spiritually attack me, I, I just keep getting better and better and better. So, yeah. Like, now, look. <laughs> look, that motherfuckers, they, they can't sleep at night. They're like, what have I done? What have I done here? Yeah. Yeah, you thought you was doing something. You thought it was sweet. So you got set down. Someone with blind hair is highly significant. Let's get a few more messages, spirit. Then we gone tap out and I'm a, I think I'm gonna do I'm gonna do another reader for y'all too tonight I think I'm gonna do I don't know I'm gonna do two more I think whatever spirits guide me to do here we have depressed they lost you for good in the reverse all right you're like I said you're unbothered you're unbothered here x all right this could be wow this could be somebody x a x of an x January is highly significant we have family secrets here. I seen public attention, so someone here is going to get publicly humil humiliated if they if they don't stand down, and that's just period. And these energies really should have did they they do diligence. They should have did their research before they came for you, because because yo yo answer is instant, instant. Clarify spiritual goal spirit. Clarify spiritual goals. It's a family involved with, with these agents as well. Taurus, all right. Your ancestors is uh is is on the neck of a Taurus here. Okay. Your spiritual goals protect you like you the president because you like I said, you're a powerful position. You are a powerful being here. You are you with a powerful mission. So you can always stay protected like the president here. You are the, the real one here. You are the real higher fan here. 
speak. Let's get a few. Let's get some closing messages here. I just seen Will of Fortune, your destiny lit. Let's get some. Okay. Pisces energy. I can't make this up. Your ancestors had to sit. These these efforts get sit down. They get a set down. A Pisces is get a set down. Okay. Or you could be a Pisces that's uh, sitting another Pisces down here. Okay. These energies could have tried. It is uh, this group magic try to sacrifice you or something. Okay. Yeah. Look, I keep saying these. All right. They regret. They regret trying to steal your identity. They regret trying to steal your essence. Okay. Because your spiritual goons ain't nothing to play with. And they, these energies are really getting set down. Okay. Love you guys. To the next video. Peace.